Hi everyone, here is how to create a flag icon in Adobe Illustrator. We're going to select the rectangle tool, create a rectangle, and we are going to create additional anchor points. And then once again, so let's go to object, path, add anchor points, and do it once again. And you can see that we have many more anchor points, which is great. Now we are going to remove the leftmost anchor points. So we're going to have the direct selection tool selected, click and drag and delete. And we need to now join these two so that there is a black line uh, similar to this side. So again, click and drag and command J or control J, or you can go to object path join. Great. Now we're going to make it a little bit shorter, like so. Cool. And now we need to select the rightmost anchor points and move them upwards and then select these uh, second, these left anchor points on the left side, left center, let's say, and move them upwards as well. So let's do it. Direct selection tool, click and drag, shift plus the upwards arrow once, twice, and the same over here, once, twice. Now it looks like a unfolded map, kind of, but we need to round these corners. We are going to again go to the, uh, the selection tool, select the shape, switch the direct selection tool by pressing A, shift and clicking these little circles over here. And once you have them selected like so, we click and drag to make it rounded. Now it actually looks like a flag. Great. What we need to do now is create the flag pole. And we are going to do that by going to the line segment tool, click and drag to make a vertical line and then align it precisely with the flag like so. Cool. Make it a little bit shorter maybe and select both of these shapes and rotate them. Here you go. Here is the flag icon in Adobe Illustrator. Super quick, super easy. And I will see you in the next one.